guys welcome back so I just brought you to the grocery store with me I am gonna go inside and show you everything that I bought today because it is a little bit different than the last one I'm trying to change things up week by week so that way we don't eat the same thing all the time so let's go inside I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I bought hopefully I give you guys some ideas if you are running out of ideas or you need something else that's something different for you or your kids so I'm gonna show you guys. Let's go ahead and bring these groceries in. All right, you guys, so here's everything that I purchased from the store today. I'm gonna go ahead and show you exactly what I bought. Okay, so I'm gonna start over here. So tonight we're having like a dinner style cheeseburger. So we are um, just using potato buns for this and we needed some bread. So I went ahead and grabbed just one loaf of bread. And obviously we go through eggs like crazy. So I grabbed um, the big pack of that. And of course, anytime we go to the store for anything, I always grab some um, turkey, cheese, and ham because my husband likes turkey, but we and the girl, me and the girls usually like ham. And I also grabbed some baked beans for a dinner tonight. So I just get like the Bush's original baked beans. Um, this one's seasoned with bacon and brown sugar. And I also grabbed a Jimmy Dean regular, it's premium pork sausage. We like to do this with biscuits and sausage in the morning um, for breakfast as well as using either these or a frozen um, brand that I have. I don't think we have any left for me to show you, but it's either this or like a frozen one. It really just depends on which one I grab when I go. And um, really wanna make some sweet tea. So I might be making you guys like a cute little short video of how to make some Southern sweet tea because I've grown up on sweet tea and I love it. And um, this is just gonna be for like one of those mornings where we're being lazy and we just wanna make some cinnamon buns. So I just grabbed um, the bigger ones because they're fluffier in my opinion. So I really like these versus the smaller ones. And as my husband's request, I couldn't find just the regular barbecue ones. I don't know if like this is the regular one and it's just um, a different one, but I really couldn't find it and it didn't look like there was a spot empty for it. But I just grabbed this and some lightly salted potato chips for myself because um, these were buy one get one free. So I thought I would just grab two different kinds. And um, this is the creamer that my husband uses. It's just a sweet cream, coffee mate, natural bliss. And um, I like this whenever I would drink coffee, which is not any, um, I don't drink coffee a lot anymore, but when I do, I like to use this at home. Um, of course, we got our kids some fruit punch and some white grape. I think the fruit punch, like I've said before, is my favorite out of the juicy juice. So I definitely get that. And then I usually grab like the white grape or the apple and just a different kind. They have different kinds um, at the store. And another thing, you guys have seen me make my tilapia. So I just grabbed one filet of tilapia for myself for like lunch one day. And um, whenever me and my husband like to snack or in the morning eat one of these, there's toaster strudels. We like the cream cheese and strawberry one. So um highly recommend that one if you're wanting to like just snack or just you're just a fat girl at heart like me and love this kind of food. I also grabbed some pizza rolls as um, another like little muncher or a lunch if we are feeling a little lazy. And of course our combination Tostino's um, party pizzas. So these are probably one of my favorites. I grew up or not grew up, excuse me. I ate these when I was pregnant with Andrea like crazy and still love them. Another thing the kids like are these Welch's fruit and um, yogurt snacks. I haven't bought in this one in a really long time, but we had two left over from like a while ago and the girls ate these and were more interested in these than the just the regular fruit snacks that I usually get. So we usually get the blue box, but this time I wanted to just get the berries and cherries fruit snacks. So I got the berry box. They were buy one, get one free. So that's why I got both. Usually I just get one. And then as my husband's request, he wanted some goldfish. So I went ahead and grabbed that, which is no big deal because the girls will obviously eat that too. And I got this the last one. I'm sure you guys saw in my Danimals, or excuse me, in my other grocery haul was the Danimal Squeezables. That one was the Strawberry Explosion, but I wanted to switch it up for the girls. And I got the Poffect, um Cotton Candy, which they've already broken into it and ate two of them, which they only come with four. So that's the only downfall. They're like almost $5 for this box. So this is probably gonna be like a once in a while thing. But sorry, and the girls are in the back like playing around. Yeah, I'm not sure if these are new or not, but I just spotted these when I went to the store maybe because I was actually looking. Oh, and they are low fat. So they contain the 1% milk fat vitamin D um, added grade A kosher K. So I like these. So if you guys have kids and would like a snack, I would definitely get this. 
and I love steaming these and putting butter on it probably the opposite of what you're supposed to do with a vegetable or whatever but um anyways I got two of the artichokes because I can steam those and um we needed some fresh garlic so I got this so we can um, chop that up and use that in some of our dinners one dinner that we're going to be doing this week is a steak dinner so I grabbed some asparagus something different we haven't had asparagus in a while so this should be really good my husband's actually going to put this on the grill instead of me putting it on the stove or in the oven and I did pick out a pound of cherries so we haven't had cherries in a little bit but the last time we did have cherries was at grandma's house so we were tearing them up all of us so I just grabbed some more because they were pretty good they look good they look pretty let me show you but they look good they look really yummy so we're probably gonna dig into these later and I do have a strawberry daiquiri um, recipe coming for you guys that I want to share. So I grabbed some lemons and I don't usually drink, but I've been wanting strawberry daiquiri and just um, every once in a while I like to make a, a drink or go out and have one. So I'm going to make one since we're staying here and we're just going to have some fun, me and my husband. So I grabbed some limes. We need to grab the other stuff at Walmart because Publix didn't have what I needed. Otherwise, the frozen strawberries and everything like that. So... Moving on to the fruit, I always grab fruit. My kids go through fruit like crazy. Like, this is one of the snacks that they love to have all the time. So I just grabbed, like, three bananas because bananas go bad quick. And since I have all this fruit, they're not going to be eating bananas every time I give them um, a fruit snack. So um, the baby likes to eat the mandarin oranges. And the only reason why I get them in this instead of in the actual produce section is because this, um, like, the strings on the oranges get caught in her... Um, throw and she chokes and everything so I like to do these in substitute of the actual orange and then of course we got some blueberries the baby's like obsessed with some blueberries this time and always make sure when you go to the store that you are checking everywhere on your blueberries because there's been so many times that I go to the store and the fruit is already um, moldy not even bought yet so I definitely um, always make sure that I check the fruit and honestly I'm thinking about going to the produce stand for a fruit next time so if you guys would like to see that video let me know and this is gonna be for the girls as well but this is also going to be for our strawberry daiquiris because I need about half a cup or a cup depending on how much we want to make <laughs> if you know what I mean so anyways I also grabbed these because I know a lot of people go crazy over these cotton candy grapes and I've been wanting to try them so grab some cotton candy grapes and they look really yummy. Okay, so this is for dinner tonight. So I don't grab all of our meat. If I like to make our meat fresh, so I like to keep it in the fridge. So I don't really grab it unless it's chicken. I'll freeze chicken, that's fine with me. But we're having cheeseburgers, so I showed you the potato um, buns that I got. So we're having cheeseburgers. I also grabbed some of that cheese in the deli that's gonna be for tonight. And um, my husband was asking for a kielbasa, but I can't remember what he was trying to make with it, but he also said like, if they don't have a small pack, then just get it and we can eat some of that for like breakfast or something or lunch or whatever. So I grabbed some more of that. Um, or so I grabbed some cow pasta and not more. I don't think I've ever bought that. Um, and of course, they didn't have our T-bone steaks as thick as my husband wanted. So I just went ahead and grabbed a porterhouse steak. And this is going to be so good one night. So we're going to marinate this overnight and probably have this tomorrow. And... Um, I'm not too sure what we're going to have for the next days. I did have it planned out, but um, something's changed. Anyways, you guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's grocery haul. And I will be bringing you probably one more because we are only staying here for three weeks. So I go for about a week um, for grocery shopping. And then obviously whatever snacks and stuff we have left over it really just depends on what I get. Like I said, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up down below. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought. And if I could give you guys some new ideas for some snacks or dinners, just let me know. Thanks, guys. I'll see you in the next Hi, one. Mommy.